The funniest kid out. Kit Test Answers Part 45. You guys have the power to literally save the entire planet. All you have to do is click the subscribe button. Trust me, trust me. I know it sounds crazy. But yeah, yeah, just uh, uh, go ahead, click the subscribe button, please. It'll really help out the channel and, it, and it'll, save the, it'll, it'll save the world. And boy, you better get that out of here. And yeah, comment down below something funny. You can put pee pee or poo poo or potty. You can put gas, or you can put your mama. Let me know. And let's go. Okay, we got the homework. It says, this boy is A, sad, or is he B, glad? They wrote in C and put, this boy is ugly. <laughs> I, I mean, that's not funny. I mean, uh, hey, 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 bad. Uh, no, don't do that. That's terrible. And the teacher wrote, enough is enough, Judy. Judy? Big booty Judy? Or, or I mean, like, like mean Judy? Judge Judy. Yeah, you judging. Don't judge people. That's not right. This boy's not ugly. He's just... Uh, he kind of no. I'm okay. All right. <laughs> the prefix uni means one. So the word unitard means, and they put one tard. <laughs> Wait, hey, that's not wrong. How am I supposed to know what a, a unitard is? Is it the thing that like like ballerinas wear? It's like the little like ballerina, like unitard. If you gonna say that uni means one, then unitard, it means one tard. What's a tard? Is it like food? Maybe it's like some type of food. I don't know, somebody look it up. Hey Siri, what is a tard? Here's an answer from Collins Dictionary. Something that is hard is very firm and stiff to touch no, and no, is not no, no. easily Hey Siri, what is a tard? Here's an answer from Collins Dictionary. Something that is hard is very firm and is not easily bent, cut, or broken. Pause. Anyway, daily word problems. Here we go. Strongest kid. Marcus is the strongest kid in second grade. He used to lift 12 pounds. Now he can lift 97 pounds. How much more can he lift now? Marcus is on steroids. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, seriously, how the heck did you go from lifting 12 pounds to 97 pounds? And look how cut Marcus is. Like, bro, he's got the defined line. He got legit muscles in the second grade, are you kidding me? He definitely on steroids. Or he just really be eating his vegetables. Eating his Wheaties and, 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 and Raisin Bran. Honey bunches of oats. You guys remember that cereal? I hated that one. Section 5. Washington's army didn't receive any support from Godzilla. <laughs> uh, they sure did not. Washington's army didn't receive any support from Godzilla. People were dying. People were getting hurt. It was all out war. Where was Godzilla? He could have came out the water and helped us out. Done something. Blew fire. Wait, does Godzilla blow fire? I mean, he's like a dragon. But I don't know. Anyway. The cookie recipe called for one cup of butter, four cups of flour, half a cup of sugar, and four teaspoons of vanilla. But Sarah, uh-oh, only has half a cup of butter. Explain how Sarah could still make the cookies without going to the store or borrowing from a neighbor. And they put steal. Hey, hey, woo, woo, woo. That, no, don't steal. That is bad, that's wrong, and that's illegal. Guys, the answer is you just make half of everything. You use half of the ingredients. If you need one cup of butter, but you only have half, then you use the half a cup of butter and then two cups of flour instead of four and you know, so on and so forth. Or you could just steal some butter. You really gonna rob a grocery store for half a stick of butter? Hands up, sucker! Now give me half a stick of butter. Quickly. Fast. Now. Yeah. I'm baking cookies for my kids. Tony practices the piano 20 minutes a day, <laughs> nerd. I mean, I'm just kidding. Effect, he is a big nerd. Hey, see, you see, you see we on the same page, yeah. I'm just kidding, uh, 20 minutes every day, that ain't even that long. You ain't never gonna be that good only practicing 20 minutes a day, you better at least practice for an hour. Come on, Beethoven, get it together. You think Mozart and Chopin only practice for 20 minutes a day? Those practicing 20 hours. Matter of fact, Tony kind of looks like Marcus, doesn't he? Is that Mar Marcus and Tony are the same person? Nah, Tony don't look as strong, so anyway. But both of y'all are white. All about me. Uh, yeah, that's not what we want to teach people. To be selfish, man. Especially right after Thanksgiving. It's Thanksgiving, not thanks greedy. Th thanks greedy. <clears throat> anyway, my name is Charlotte. I am two and a half years old. How the heck do you write perfectly at two and a half years old? I swear, the teacher wrote this. People who are important to me are my family. Oh, that's <laughs> nice. Some of my favorite things are minions, baby dolls, the Rebel Alliance, 
What is wrong with you? I don't like Grandpa Joe. Wow, 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 that's your family. I thought you said people who are important to me are my family. Grandpa Joe is your family. Why don't you like Grandpa Joe? Because he smells like old people? Smells like mothballs? Does he smell like World War One? Let me know. What is negative six? And they put a number. <laughs> The savagery is real. They're not wrong. Negative six is a number. Like, what do you want me to put? What is negative six? I don't know. It, a number. Six below zero. Jeez. What is it? A, a prime number? Like, like, is it an integer? Like, I don't know. I never paid attention in geography. On your own, Saturn, Uranus, pause, and Neptune have at least three things in common. List them. One, they are all planets. Two, they are all round. Three, None of them have McDonald's. You don't know that. They could have McDonald's on Uranus. Oh my God. That sounds good though. Uh, get that Big Mac, large fry, two apple pies, and a McFlurry. Gotta get that M&M McFlurry. <laughs> Short answer, number five, worth 10 points. Provide an example of a risk, and they put no. <laughs> That's a risk. And you got a check mark. Congratulations. Does that count as getting 10 points? I don't know. Shout out to what's his name? JTH. JTH, don't be playing around. JTH came to school ready to go to detention. He wants all the smoke. I mean, gosh dang. Said no. Look how many lines there are. You really not gonna fill up all that space? Filled up your mama last night. Okay, anyway. Geometry, shape. Name these 2D shapes. Easy peasy, booty squeezy. So like the square, you're supposed to name it a square, but they put Jade, Charlotte, Charlie, Sophia, Harriet, Emily, Maria. Emily the triangle, really? That's what's going on up in geometry? At least make it like Charlie the triangle or like, you know, Sophia the circle. I mean, that, that works. Maria the octagon, girl, get up on out of here. Would you recommend this book to a friend and why? No, it is my favorite and I don't want anyone else to have it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, keep it to yourself, you nerd. That's ridiculous. You really not gonna share this uh, amazing book? Don't you wanna talk about the book with somebody else? Or do you not have friends? I mean, like, I don't know. I mean, it's, it's fine if you don't. I didn't have friends until last week. My mom worked hard today. She deserves a microwaved hot dog. No thanks, I'm okay without that. I don't want a microwaved hot dog. You better boil that in some water. Throw it on the barbecue grill. I need my hot dog dog piping hot not microwaved if you microwave a hot dog it's still gonna be cold in the middle and ain't Hello nobody got time for that. that choose a word from the box to complete each sentence you got listen busy eyes and high okay so all you had to do is fill in the blank and was to listen to help her sister no and was too busy to help her sister and was too eyes to help her sister but they put Anne was too high to help her son. <laughs> she was smoking drugs. Doing contraband. Even though that, like, I think, like, marijuana is legal. Anyway, Anne was too high to help her sister. Wow, Anne. You're a drug addict. You need some help. You need an intervention and you need to go to rehab. Amy Winehouse. At least they got the second one right. Freckles the cat has green eyes. There you go. I'm surprised they didn't put Freckles the cat has green listen. <laughs> F words. Okay, all right, let's write some F words. And they put fart, ew! What, 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 what the heck is this? What is that, what, is that a butt and legs? Why is one leg malnourished? And then the other leg is just thick and fat. And what is this yellow stuff that's coming out, man? You got yellow coming out of your butt? That's a problem. Or is that like the front? Is that the prostate? I don't know. So you fart yellow? Is that what goes down? Is that what the cool people are doing? <laughs> Dang. You gonna put that on your B-reel? <laughs> oh, not today. Construct a banana car. No, I, I want to retake this this test. You need to retake this this grammar. Nobody told you to construct a banana car. You crossed out the instructions. Rectangle. Construct a rectangle with sides Y and N Z. What kind of dreams are you having to where you want to make a banana car? Don't you know that's just gonna smell like potassium? Mm -mm, not today. But if you enjoyed this video, then go ahead, give it a like. And yeah, I'ma see ya in the next one. Peace.